Today, I ended my work from home journey. I've been working from home for almost two months and finally, it comes to an end. Working from home has become the new normal during coronavirus lockdown. At least, for the lucky people who are still employed and haven't been designated essential. And without a commute, it seems one of the most urgent challenges is turning off at the end of the day, knowing where work ends and home begins. Work from home has its own advantages such as environmentally friendly you have more time with your family less stressful environment a quieter atmosphere and eliminating the long commute but obviously there were lots of disadvantages too. Let's not mention that anyway. Clearly, things are only going to get back to normal slowly. Some of the people I know have been starting to wonder about life after the circuit breaker order have been lifted. What will it be like? And what will the new normal be? The answers to those questions will depend a lot on where you live, what your experience has been like, and what you make out of it. Living in the city that imposed circuit breaker order seven weeks ago of this video, my old life has been a mixed bag. I shifted to work from home pretty easily, but it's been hard finding a routine and avoiding distractions. I am looking forward to hugging people that I miss sharing meals with my family, cracking jokes with my colleagues during lunch breaks, and celebrating special occasions with my loved ones. I am connected with my family and friends online. But I miss their physical presence.
speaking is a form of a self-expression. I create what I want to create. However little or magnificent that big good may be. And not to mention is a double warming of awesomeness. Baking makes me happy, and baked goods makes everyone happy. Spreading joy is immensely powerful. Starting tomorrow will be a new journey and hurdles that I never thought I would never have to jump over. A new role at work begins to say that I am both scared and nervous is an understatement. It was a surprise and now it has finally arrived. I want to do better than my best. I want to flourish and succeed. I am, however, terrified that I am not good enough, not smart enough, and just not enough. I am scared my anxiety and doubt will run amok inside my head. So hopefully, I will find my group. 